and welcome back to Montana. This is called Montana 2. But quite frankly, I don't remember if I made that up or that's what they called it. It's of course coming from DuPage. Well, those cosmic bullets definitely came from the northeast. There's a little negated energy. And this reminds me of some of those chemtrail clouds, th those stratified patterns we see there, like putting sand on a plate and vibrating it with the proper sonic frequencies that generates patterns whose name I can't remember but I think it starts with a C as I explored the idea in the last series these stations and since this is state, it's not a station-based image, but rather a mosaic. These stations can show things within a given circular area whose circles overlap and this type of cl ground clutter perhaps is the most acceptable name for it since we don't really know what it is but they don't although I can see emerging there th they don't show up on each other's uh, screen even when the screens overlap I, I'm gonna enjoy looking at the direction of those cosmic bullets and see if it has to do with the time of the day or the night if we're going through the tail of a comet type of thing and the meteor showers are flying through or the radial torsion effect up there. number of storms here I'm sorry not storm circles in a mosaic form that you can't really see unless there is a storm now wait a minute I think I just saw something interesting there those cosmic bullets went that way I think these not only come this way I think they get fatter no I think they I'm backing it up a frame at a time well one interesting thing is they're there for two frames. There's one frame and it's still there. It's coming straight out of that station and so is that one. It isn't what I thought it was. And that one too. One, two, three in a row sequentially, both of all three of them lasting two frames, which is 
a five minute separation so how long were they on I think they must be on a lot <laughs> <laughs> 